Hi, my name is Vaidhanathan Babu, team leader of Quantum Quotients from Radhalakshmi Institute of Technology, Chennai. Problem statement we have chosen is Smart and Effective Real-Time Management of Street Parking, which comes under the Ministry of Housing and Urban Affairs. The theme is Smart Automation and the problem statement code is 1515. Over to Sangeeta to explain the problem statement. Hi everyone, this is a team of Quantum Quotients. We all know that India is a very populous country. And also, the population of India reaches more than 140 crores. So, the mentality of every Indian's people is to have their own vehicle as well as their own house. But they don't have the parking space for parking their vehicles. And also, in nowadays in India, the number of private vehicles is increasing drastically. So, this leads to every traffic jam and as well as the pollution in the cities as well as in the streets. So, to solve that, we have to give an application-based solution for this problem. Next for solution, over to Saranya. So, the solution that we provide consists of a mobile application which is designed to streamline the parking reservation process. It offers users to book their parking slots in a seamless and time-saving method. So, our application initiates with getting input from the user whether the vehicle is a two-wheeler, four-wheeler or large vehicles like truck and lorries. Upon inputting the vehicle type, our application presents users with a list of nearby parking slots and recommends the best option considering various factors like price, wait list and such other relevant data. Upon selecting a parking slot, the application provides a real-time information on the availability of slots and the slots that are booked. And the users can reserve their desired parking slot using some reservation fee and for two-wheeler, there is no reservation fee. After the payment is successful, the users can go to their respective slots and then there, their uh, number plate will be verified. After verification process is done, the users are directed to their respective slots using AR sensors. And then the same happens with four wheelers. Upon arrival to their parking slot, their number plate will be verified. And then they, after verifications, they are, uh, the users will be redirected to their respective parking slot using AR sensors. Hi, I'm going to talk about the software implementation in this video. So to make our model, we use Python. Python offers a wide range of modules and is very user friendly. So we use namely Kinter, Bootstrap, TDK, Connector, Pillow, etc. to make our user interface. For the backend process, we use SQL as our data is largely structured and is easier to be stored in the form of tables or relations. We use Maps API, which is uh, used for lo their location services and real-time tracking updates. We use a wide range of machine learning and deep learning algorithms like Dijkstra, ASTAR, uh, CNN, etc which will be explained in the later in this video. Uh, CNN, the whole point of using CNN is because it is specifically designed for image recognition and it will be very useful in identifying patterns and uh, textures in objects and classes. Thank you and over to Surya to explain the algorithms. CNN or Convolutional Neural Networks is a set of deep learning model which is specifically used for image recognition tasks. CNN consists of many layers like convolutional layer, pooling layer, etc., which are interconnected. Right? So, CNN looks for textures or patterns in the input image and classifies them based on it. It is widely used for facial recognition tasks. So, how we look to implement CNN in our model is that we surveillance the parking slots with cameras and then we train cameras with labeled data sets of uh, park, empty parking slots and parking slots filled with vehicles. So this is how the camera will be able to look for patterns and tell whether the parking slot is vacant or occupied. What is an algorithm? Algorithm is a mathematical ma mapping method used to learn or uncover underlying, underlying patterns embedded in the data. We use Google API. In Google API, two algorithms we use is used. Dijkstar algorithm and A star algorithm. Dijkstar algorithm is a graph search that finds the shortest path between two nodes in a weighted graph. It means a periodic queue of nodes to explore start from the starting point to the source node with a distance of zero and incrementally updating the distance to neighboring nodes by considering the weights. In Dijkstar algorithm, the efficient 
Dyke's algorithm is efficient for finding the shortest spot in non-negative weighted graph and it is widely used in navigation, network, network routing and other optimization problem. And a star algorithm is a popular path finding algorithm used in computer science and, uh, and artificial intelligence. It efficiently finds the shortest path from starting node to a target node in a weighted graph or grid. Uh, a star algorithm that the benefits of Dyke star algorithm and greedy best for search by considering the both the actual cost the start from start for start node algorithm explores the Note in order of the their estimated total cost and favoring modes, they are likely to lead the shortest path. They are likely to lead the shortest path. And yes, the algorithm guarantees an optimal solution when it's a consistent futuristic is used and uh, making it valuable in various applications, including robotics, video games, and uh, routing. Hi, my name is Vishal. I'm going to talk about the business perspective of our project. Let us take the example of Chennai City. Chennai has whopping of 180 localities. 180 localities are divided into 15 different zones. When we do math, it sums up to 12 localities per zone. Let us consider a minimum of 2 parking stations per locality. It comes up to 24 parking stations per zone. Let us take 1000 two-wheelers, 1000 cars parked at an instant. This totals to 3 lakh rupees per zone. On, the, on doing the math, the revenue across the 180 localities adds up to an approximate of 75 lakhs per month. There is no individual salaries involved, which makes to take home amount an hefty one. This cost will include maintenance amount and security salary. Taking into an account a uh, standard inflation rate of 2%, the amount is not set to take a dip because number of two wheelers will only increase over time, which said in a prediction to a survey conducted by Volvo Corporation.